The eerie R of Joe Gacy filling the whole arena here tonight. Peel away the mystique, Cole, and you'll see Gacy as the true competitor that he is. He's found an impressive balance between wild brawling and technical mat technique that's managed to make him as dangerous inside of the ring as he is outside of it. It's hard to imagine an even more dangerous Joe Gacy, but maybe we'll see it here tonight. And he's taking on someone who acts like he has nothing to lose. I don't care who you are, taking on an opponent with that mindset is always dangerous. No! Oh, the high risk doesn't pay off! A brutal impact after taking a gigantic gamble like that. Oh, man. with the crossbody. As we've seen time and time again, Joe Gacy loves to get into his opponent's heads, loves to create conflict and doubt where there previously was none. Exactly, Cole, which is why when you're facing off against Gacy, you have to shut out the noise. Sure, Gacy's saying some interesting things that are all, of course, true, but you can always wait until after the match to acknowledge that. And that was a precisely measured attack. Looking for an early pin. It bypasses the pinfall. He might have been putting the cart before the horse with that pin, but it was worth a try. Back into the ring. Oof. He gets what he deserves for all that gloating. Put into the corner now. Well, Crisscross action. And what a rolling elbow. Looking to catch him off guard. And he gets the shoulder up. Not even a two count for him. Clawing the face, is this necessary? Rip it at the eyes. The damage he's taken is starting to pile up. Yeah, the calculating side of Gacy was really on full display. That could be it. He forces a break before the count of two. Frankly, he should have known that wasn't enough. Joe is feeding off the WWE Universe. Long fall and even harder impact. There's actually no regard for your opponent's safety when you toss them to the outside like that. He turns it around. We're going to see it. Gut wrench power bomb. A power bomb not meant to be pretty, but oh man, does it get the job done. Yeah, I'm pretty sure they don't want to be taking any more of those. And that DDT was well delivered. An impressive sequence from Joe. Joe's doing whatever he wants, because he can. Oh, stop right to the hand. And if the first stop doesn't send you the message, the follow-up ones definitely will. Thrown back in under the ropes. From the ground up. Suplex. Oh, suplex. Oh, this is just disrespectful. And an elbow drop, too. He's been quickly taking control here. Yeah, he has planted himself in the driver's seat. Fends off the attack with an elbow. But he still has more work to do to get this fully in his favor. And frustration might be starting to set in. We may be moments away from Gacy's demise. Up into the torture rack. Bad spot for Gacy. Makes the cover. He kicks out somehow. I can't believe that this whole arena is in shock. Yeah, but no one's more shocked than the man who thought he had a pinfall. Throwing everything in the kitchen sink in there, but to no avail. He's looking a little weary now. There's been plenty of action in this match, and the cost of that is really showing now. Getting him into the corner. Joe capitalizes on that misstep. And finds a counter. And oh my God, what a fall! That's a jump. Need a midsection. Bang to the neck. 
Both wrists captured. And that was nasty. Oh, unloading a big kick to the back. Gacy has lost any sense of command in this one. And he's been refusing to let Gacy into his head. And look at him now, staying one step ahead with that mindset. No, a two count. How in the world did he kick out? I don't know how there is anything left in these superstars' bodies. Yeah, the tank is being emptied tonight. Oh, man, the rep needs to get out of the way. DDT! And that's some late match offense from Joe. At this stage, I don't know where Joe gets this undeniable aggression. Oh, goodness, what a moonsault. That was mounted with punches. And not, oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. Elbow thrown to break up the maneuver. DDT! The WWE Universe is pouring more fuel on his fire right now. That's a bad landing. Into the barricade. And a series of vicious stomps. Throws the opposition back into the ring. Pump kick. Off the ropes. Leg drop. An impressive sequence from Joe. Yeah, Joe is really remaining the aggressor here. I don't know about you two, but I can barely hear my own thoughts. The WWE Universe is making their feelings heard loud and clear. Stop in the leg. Joe is locked in on his opponent now. Close lock. Does he have him here? Kicks out. He still has life. I am shaking my head in disbelief over how he managed to get the shoulder up. Crank in the head. Leg drop. Gacy's got him right where he wants him. Oh, my goodness. What reflexes to stop Gacy? Stomping away, punishing their opponent. Just relentless with this assault. They double knee to the chest. He switches it back around. Quick exchange, reversing the reversal. Man, this place is jumping in a suplex. Both wrists captured and Ooh. boom! Good night! What a knee! Oh, what a right hand! Is it enough? The cover! Two count! It's over! Brutality finally comes to an end. Here is your winner! A maddening loss for Joe Gacy here. I think Gacy might need to refocus after tonight because the current mindset just didn't get the job done.